Okay, so now we know what a single loss expectancy is. That basically means whenever this loss occurs, we know how much money we're going to lose. But now we need to figure out what is the annual probability of a loss. Keep in mind, the purpose for all this is to evaluate which controls we need to implement to protect us from specific losses. Losses all have dollar figures associated with them because we're doing quantitative risk assessment. So the budgetary folks are interested in how many losses were going to occur in a year. So that's why we stick with the annual probability of loss. We refer to that as the ARO, the annual rate of occurrence. This basically says, okay, I know what my loss is going to be, but how often am I likely to have a disk crash? Well, again, you're going to have to go back to statistics and look at the particular machine classification, look at the history and your usage and figure out exactly what the annual rate of occurrence will be. It's an estimate of the probability a stated threat will be realized. And it's going to be slightly different for every type of stated threat. Once you know the annual rate of occurrence, the way you calculate the estimated loss of a specific realized threat is simply multiply the single lost expectancy times the annual rate of occurrence. And that becomes the annual loss expectancy. All right, let's take a look at it again. The annual loss expectancy. How much am I expected to lose if this threat is realized every single year? Is equal to the amount you're going to lose for a single loss occurrence times the probability it's going to occur or the number of times it'll occur in a year.